Okay, let's talk about what actually makes your heart beat because it's not the brain, it's actually the heart's own built-in electrical system. Every heartbeat starts at the SA node. This is the heart's natural pacemaker. It sits in the right atrium and fires about 60 to 100 times per minute, sending electrical impulses across the atria. This is what creates the P wave on an ECG. That signal then travels to the AV node, where it pauses for a split second. This delay is actually crucial. It lets the atria finish contracting before the ventricles then kick in. From there, the impulse shoots down the bundle of his, splits into the right and left bundle branches, and spreads through the Purkinje fibers. This causes the ventricles to contract. This is that big spike you see as the QRS complex. If the SA node fails, the AV node can take over at 40 to 60 beats per minute. And if that fails, the ventricles then have their own backup pacemaker. And it's super slow, around 20 to 40 beats per minute. That's why when we see things like heart blocks or bundle branch blocks, it tells us exactly where the electrical signal got delayed or stopped. If you want a quick study guide that breaks down cardiac conduction, ECG changes, and what each block actually means, comment cardiac down below on my Instagram video and I will send that right to your DMs.